program, this is uh, something interesting because usually uh, for chocolate coating, it's usually used in dessert or as a chocolate sauce to serve in, in game. But, but uh, to serve as a foie gras itself is a, something interesting and then uh, you, have, you have a different uh, combination with bitter chocolate and the sweetness of the pork wine marinated with the foie gras itself. So we also get a different textures also. We have soft in the inside and it's crunchy in the outside. intelligent use of ingredients yeah? especially with the compressed watermelon right it intensifies the taste uh, and the flavor and of course he pairs you off with a uh, tomato gazpacho and with a uh, little bit uh, acidity which comes from the raspberry vinegar and the uh, vinegar adds uh, a flavor to the, the whole dish itself too which consists of three components. You can feel the natural taste of the caviar followed by the rich creamy ragu and the last layer is a wrestling jelly that will balance out your palate after tasting. This is a Norwegian salmon, which is actually poached in milk, in a milk bar. Usually you will confit a salmon in oil, but this is made in milk, so it makes the salmon very soft. And then you serve it in a barn snip soup, uh, which is uh, a little bit creamy, you know. So you have the soft texture of the fish, and then you have the creamy soup, and then it is garnish uh, with Japanese tabuka and uh, there is some Japanese uh, crispy rice. So you have a lot of different textures. a duo of raspberry. Now, the fresh raspberries is spread into two components. One we made into a dry powdered form, which is called frizzy. Uh, this little frizzy is made out of fresh raspberry, uh, dry, and then uh, it is like a powder, but then it is quite a, a little bit of a, a crumble. And when you eat it, it is not sour. It has a little bit of texture of like a powdery, uh, uh, pleasant taste in your palate. So when you go with the sherbet, which is made out of lemon juice, fresh raspberry puree and fresh raspberries. A lot of raspberries in my tongue now. So, and you made it into a sherbet. And when you eat them together, it's a very nice combination. Well, eat it like a fresh raspberry town, you know, like, wow. Well, it, it, it is nice to have it in your palate and the next dish you enjoy more. So, bon appetit. This. I first learned it when I was a kitchen helper. Over the years, I've been trying to perfect this dish. And uh, why it's so special about this dish is this chicken is specially farmed and it's fed with a special grain. That's why it's so flavorful. It 
this dish is also a winning dish by the Singapore national team and I would like to share with all of you. What's so special about this dessert are the unique combination between rosemary and pear and caramel in proper. And the biggest surprise is in the chocolate bowl.